armadillo eggs for the win today outside. It's raining, it's wet. Let's enjoy it the best we can. Kids are napping. Let's see how long this takes. I feel like it's gonna take a while. Whatever, let's hit it. All right, welcome back to another episode of Bites Out Back. Thank you so much for watching. Um, today is a little bit different. I'm coming off the main deck down to the shed. It's been raining most of the day. Um, as you can see, it's looking pretty dreary out here. So today I'm gonna be cooking up some armadillo eggs. If you don't know what they are, it's essentially a jalapeno pepper stuffed with cream cheese and cheddar cheese wrapped in a chorizo sausage. And then you could either have them wrapped in bacon or not wrapped in bacon and cooked on the grill. So they're super simple, super tasty, kind of like an appetizer. It's actually really good. I'm gonna go over the ingredients right now and I'm just gonna throw them up on the screen as I'm talking. So they didn't have any ground pork at the grocery store. So I ended up just buying a pack of chorizo sausages. I just uh, cut the casings and put it all in a Bowl, mix it together and yeah I just use that as my patties to wrap the jalapeno pepper second I have one pack of cream cheese with one cup of shredded cheddar cheese mixed into that same bowl and I actually put in some of the spatchcock cowboy hot sauce that I have uh, some of that smoky habanero and some of that jalapeno dill just to really liven up the flavor on the inside. So that is the filling for the jalapeno peppers. Third, I have jalapeno peppers that are cored. Took out all the seeds, all the inside, cut the tops off to allow me to fill it with the cream cheese filling. And the last thing, I'm gonna be making some without bacon and some with bacon. So here we go, let's get into these armadillo eggs. Thanks so much again for watching. Thanks for sticking around. And yeah, let's hit it. All right, for my assembly, I got my cream cheese grated cheese mixture going into a Ziploc bag. Easy to fill these hollowed out jalapeno peppers. I'm gonna have four to six ounces of chorizo sausage flattened out into a patty, put my jalapeno onto that patty, mold it around to form a giant egg. And once that's done, I am now ready for bacon. I think these eggs took about two strips of bacon each and yeah, see you outside. I'm gonna go ahead and get these armadillo eggs on the grill and I'll just keep you guys posted as we go It's probably gonna be a slow go to be completely honest um, But yeah, we got time. Let's see how it goes <laughs> So now that we're back by the shed, today's beer review is another beer from Chronicle Brewery. It's called Lando Caljusian. It's a pretty sick can, not gonna lie. It's an IPA. This is a good strong beer, it's about 6%. So again, Lando Caljusian IPA, Chronicle Brewery. Let's get it poured out. All right, let's give it a go. It's just another good IPA. Can't really go wrong. I should research it. I don't really know what the difference is between a milkshake IPA and this kind of IPA. I feel like I like the milkshake IPAs better. This is still a great beer. I'd highly recommend. Lando Caljusian, let's get going. All right, so if you're wondering where I got this recipe from, uh, my cousin-in-law actually pointed me in the direction of using the Traeger Grills recipe. So this is right from the Traeger website. For those of you who don't know, Traeger, they make barbecues really good. It's a pellet grill. Obviously this is not a Traeger, but the recipe is really good. Super, super simple, and yeah. Get a glimpse of that armadillo egg. How good does that look? This looks incredible, you see that? See the cheese poking out? It's gonna be incredible. I'm gonna have a couple snacks going, a couple jalapeno poppers, why not? Amidst the rain, the beer, why not have a little snack? A little jalapeno popper, let's go. This is what we're looking at right here. That's the inside of your armadillo egg. This is the uh, bacon wrapped one, if you can't tell. It's pretty tasty, not gonna lie. So I'm gonna go ahead and give this one a taste with the beer. So here we go, another Chronicle beer. Ran out of the first one, took way longer than expected. And here we go. This is the armadillo egg. Kurt, thanks for the uh, recommendation on this recipe. Should be good. Let's see how it tastes. 
Mm, mm. Make sure that it's chorizo sausage you do this with. It's so good. It's like candy. It's a little barbecue candy. Mm. You see the cheese dripping out on the thumb? This is definitely something good to do while you're camping. Nice little treat, change things up a bit. They don't take very long if you know what you're doing. Clearly, I'm an amateur at this. But yeah, armadillo eggs for the win. Mm. And again, so you can see, it's a chorizo and bacon wrap jalapeno popper. That's all it is. But man, I'm telling you, this is incredible. It's packed full of flavor. Keto friendly for those who uh, are partaking in keto. Very good, very tasty. It's everything you think it would be. Try this out, you'll enjoy it. Try it this summer when you're camping. I mean, the flavor of the barbecue probably helps too with the charcoal, probably makes a big difference. Either way, thanks for watching. Here's an armadillo egg. Hope you enjoyed. See you next time on Bites Out Back. Thanks so much, peace.